And I was on a call with a client, the other, another client, potential client, I'm, and I'm following what's in the portal step by step, sword and shield, mm -hmm. and and all the good stuff. Yep. And the call went great, right? And so we've been going back and forth via email. Okay. And my inclination here is I like to just give him a call and kind of close this deal. Agree, a hundred percent. I, yeah, right. I've given him my phone number and multiple times, but I have this trepidation to move forward and, and just you know, find his email, find his phone number on Apollo or Lucia and call him, right? Because he hasn't really taken that step. So um, I guess I'm really looking for advice at this point. Yeah. Van, what step are you at with them? Because I'm a bit confused. Do they have a contract in front of them? Yes or no? No, there's no, there's no contract. I'm just advancing. Okay. Um, and so we're approaching close and okay. uh, I feel like, you know, it's between like two, another competitor. Sure. And we're approaching close. At okay. This point. They, they need to close before the middle of December. So why do they need to close before the middle of December? Because the contract starts or the contract with their vendor starts in the beginning of January. Okay. So I want you to call them right after this call and say, yeah. Hey, Matt, it's, uh, what's the name? Well, I'll just use, I'll say I was calling you. Hey, exactly. Matt, it's, uh, hey, Van, it's, it's Matt with Easton University calling to see if it makes sense for me to shoot over the contract because I know we're coming up here on that mid-December mark. Can you give me a call on my mobile 720-660-3202? Notice what I didn't say. Hey Van, it's Matt, I hope you're doing great. Uh, happy Wednesday to you, hump day. Um, wow, that sounded a little weird, um, but hey, you know, I, I, I get kind of weird. I just wanted to see, because I really enjoyed our conversation on our last meeting, and I know I had sent you an email, and you hadn't responded to that email. I just wanted to see if you guys were maybe perhaps still interested in trying us out. Um, if so, let me know so I can get a contract over. Here's what you want to say. Hey Van, Matt Easton, Easton University, call in to see if it makes sense to send over the contract so we can get everything taken care of before the mid-December mark with your other vendor. Full stop, period. There's a no, that's a no lose for you. Because if they don't respond to that voicemail, you can then send an email with those exact words. You can, if they respond and say no, got it, what's a good next step? Um, I did, well, yeah, go I ahead. I sent them an email this morning, so... Call them. Forget it. What does it mean, guys, who knows the answer? I know a bunch of you know the answer. Unmute yourself. What does it mean when somebody doesn't call you back? What does it mean when nothing. somebody... It's nothing. Means nothing. 